Redline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman, the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, coming up straight off this TFNN noon update. I'm also the author of the opening call, Daily News Dad. We're going to give a webinar on some of the techniques, uh, the arches and the cups and the different formations that we're always looking at coming this Tuesday evening, uh, 5 o'clock to 6 o'clock, uh, 6.30, that is. For subscribers, let's go 145 up, all-time high in the Dow, 27,926, getting closer and closer to the 28,000 level, 27,954 was the high today, and it gapped up going into this all-time high. So this is going to be very important because if it sustains 27,720 to 27,650 support into Tuesday, You've gapped up and you've actually started a new level of uh, support short term. But if there's a turn down by the end of the day, these options expiration, if there's a turn down by the end of the day or by Monday or Tuesday, and you start to see a pullback towards the 27,000 where we were just uh, this morning, the low was 27,843. So if we go to 27,780, in the next couple of days, say, OK, could be a little bit, uh, a little overboard here. I'm going to have time for a rest. Looking at the S&P, the S&P is just, uh, it's up a slightly more percentage. Um, it's up, let me just get that. Sorry, he's right here. So the S&P at this particular moment is up uh, 18 at 3,114, all-time high. Recycled, this is now leg F, going into the inside track repellent zone. Good technicals, um, and we're watching the key support now of 3,098. Uh, leg C in the weekly chart, very good. QQQ, NDX 100, having a good day, up to up 1.13 to 202.57, all-time high. Key support now is in the two. No, he's in the 199.30 area. This is very short term. Weekly and monthly charts are looking good. IWM was lagging a bit yesterday. Today, it's right there with all the others, but it's way under the all time high. Uh, not way under the all time high, but under the most recent high, 160.46 as well. Needs to hold 157 going into Tuesday. Now, gold had a very nice couple of days of, of upside spike. It's down seven right now at 1466, and the dollar hasn't been able to benefit from that. It is still down 13 ticks at 98.04. We'll talk about bonds and crude oil when we get back stay tuned tiger technicians hour coming straight up and then you got steve rhodes dave white and tom o'brien otherwise have a great day have a good weekend see you on monday